Taiwan and I uh, identify as such. And uh, that my people is from central Taiwan, it's so called Baze people. And uh, I have went to education in Canada, so I uh, started international networking as a little bit more perspective. And I consider myself an expert also in China history and uh, geography and the people who got travel there. Some academic research, I published some paper and also news article. Um, but why Taiwan is today? Why there are people, uh, indigenous people? Uh, let me just uh, frame what uh, Mr. Loder has asked. Taiwan has, yeah, you're right, about one and a half million population, which uh, officially recognized 16 groups. That's about, they say, the, uh, what are, it's about close to 4% of uh, total population. Mm -hmm. Taiwan total is 23 million. But government, which is for a long time KMT, a China Kuomintang who lost the civil war with China, come to Taiwan with a military <coughs> conquest. They consider us not as uh, indigenous people. In fact, we are the plain Aborigine. There are about 10 different groups. And under KMT, even under now the DPP government, they are more pro Taiwan. We are still not recognized. But if you count from what uh, academics and uh, people like us, activists, there may be also uh, uh, under under half million or like uh, 200,000, maybe around there, people who are willing to recognize uh, as such. Because indigenous people in Taiwan, is a, for a long time, it's a very problem. In, in China, KMT terminology were considered as one, it means like uh, uncivilized people or primitive people. In the more derogatory term, it means like savage. So people are ashamed under KMT education. Remember, KMT has the longest time hold power since uh, after the Second World War. They come over Taiwan military conquests, massacre a lot of Taiwan uh, intelligent, uh, intelligentsia and mm -hmm. early people. So the history of Taiwan is under the Chinese mentality, education media, for over seven decades. Since 19, late 1940s, it's effectively KMT empowered the Chinese mindset, China, uh, the Chinese uh, uh, mindset, until 2016. 2016, that's when the DPP really holds power. The Democratic Progressive Party of Taiwan, which is under Taiwan, 2016. They 